Ah, oh, stayed right. Boom. Oh my god. That is so Tell you what, this could be really good. This could be very good. Oh my god, that's so that should be so good. That's a little bit right. Guys. Welcome back to another video on the channel. Today we're back up here at Ballymena Golf Club where we're going to be playing a nine hole course vlog. We're currently on the back nine at the minute on the channel guys. If you haven't seen the front nine yet, that was posted on Friday so it was past. So if you haven't seen that guys, go check it out. Very interesting video. The golf was actually somewhat decent this time around. But anyway, if you haven't seen it, the link will be down in the comment section below. Go check it out. Interesting video. But anyway, Ballymena Golf Club, nine hole course vlog. How well can we do? Back nine. Let's get it, come on. So to start off hole 10, it's a par 3, 179 yards. Uh, playing downwind a little bit, so I've got a 7 iron in hand. Hopefully it's enough club to get me there. Oh, that is so good. That is so good. Come in a little bit. Staying left on me a little bit. Tell you what, that's not a bad strike. Left hand side, I think we're a hedge bit short or we're on line with the green. So yeah, we're just... Basically in line with the green, a little bit to the left. I've got 58 degree in hand here. Hopefully it's enough club. Just gonna try and chip one on, let it roll out. That could be a really good chip. Keep going, please keep going. Ah, it was okay. Look, see once it left the face of the club there, actually, I actually thought it was gonna roll out a little bit, a little bit more, but we're par putting. Can't complain, we're par putting. Ah, oh, I tell you what, I think I went a little bit too much left edge. Tap in bogey. There we have it. A bogey to start the 10th hole of the back nine. Come on, that's not bad. That's not bad. So, currently on hole 11, it's 395 meters, whatever that is in yards. So, driver in hand. Just try and get one down the middle of the fairway. Boom. It feels great when you hit a good one, I have to say. See, I just wish all my drives were like that, I really do. But down the middle, come on. So, middle of the fairway, shot to 160 yards, eight iron in hand. Hopefully it's enough club. Some shots are just look so different in the season. It's drifting a little bit. Just over the bunkers to the right hand side. Every time I play a swap to the right hand side, over the bunkers. Shot free, we're actually in the bunker. It actually looked like it went over, but we're not. We're actually in it. I'm gonna try a nice little 58 degree, try and get it out. 58 degrees just my club for everything. You probably noticed that. Yeah, it's probably one to forget about there. Not great. Hit the hell roll out. Didn't roll out as much, but this is for bogey, guys. Can we get the bogey? Can we get the bogey? Straight at it. There's a double. Another double on the cards. Ah, There's a double bogey, guys. I didn't really want any doubles there. Went on to the back nine, but we've started bogey double. Something similar to... Something similar to uh, the front nine. As I say, guys, if you haven't seen that, the link will be down in the comment section. Go check it out. Hole 12, par 4, 354, I think it is, yards. Target is obviously in between the trees and the telegraph pole down there to the left. But anyway, driver hand, try and get a nice straight one down there. Oh, it should be okay. It should be okay there. It's still turning a little bit. What the hell? Yeah, it's okay. Shot to you, wrong fairway. I'm gonna let this guy play free. Got a nine iron in hand. I'm just hoping it's enough club. A little bit left. Everyone's going left on me today. Yeah, bounce left, kicking left. Not bad. Shot free. Second shot was pulled left there. Obviously, my alignment wasn't great there, but no excuse. <clears throat> so, playing shot free. 58 degree in hand, just try and hit this little bank of the hill, hopefully it rolls out. 
Bait, 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 bait. <clears throat> Tell you what, it's not bad. I'll take that, guys, not bad. So, can we get the par? Can we get the par? Oh my god, I didn't hit it. Tap in, bogey. Back nine is nowhere near as good as the front nine, guys. But anyway, it's a bogey, and on we go to the next. Hole 13, it's par 4. I shouldn't. I don't think I should be hitting driver here. I think it is like 270, 280 yards. I don't think I'm going to make it, but for course management, I probably should be hitting an iron or a wood. But anyway, let's try and get the driver down there. Oh, it stayed right. Hopefully there's no one over there. Oh, it's clear. That's so bad. That's such a bad strike. Shot too. Good job there's no one on the tee box. That's all I'm saying. 50 at the green hand. Let's try and get one over these trees and on. That's what you call fend. Fend it and it's rolled right off the back, guys. So, I've absolutely fend the life out of a 58 degree. As I say, a 58 degree, but 58 degree either goes 60 yards or 260. And we're sitting here at the back now. That is so bad. So bad, I need this for par. I think this is the easiest on the course. Par. Roll, roll, roll. Hopefully we can get that for a bogey. We really do not want to be double bogey in this hole. Left edge of the cup. And there's the bogey. Take that all day long. That was a really scruffy hole. Hole 14, par 3. 191 yards, 5 iron in hand. Just try and get one down there. Just try and get one down there. Oh, it's a little bit right. I say a little bit, that's a good bit right. Right over the top, we've got a good chip shot on here. That's what I need. Shot two, 50 at the green hand. That was what you call a slicey one there. But anyway, 50 at the green hand, just get it over the bunker. Hopefully it just rolls down. That could be good. That could be really good. Keep going. Oh my God, keep going. Tell you what, that's a really good chip. Going to take the flag out, just because I don't want to hit the. Oh, just because I don't want to hit the the pin. This is for par. This could be a really ugly par if we get this. Ugly par indeed. It's going to go slight, slight the inner bit of the left cup. Hopefully, it's the right call. Oh come on! It's going to be a bogey, top end bogey. There we go. Oh, I had taken the flag out for a bogey. That's, that's pathetic. But there it is, guys. A bogey. Great chip to bogey. Wow. Hole 15, 321 yards. Big dog in hand. I did see one of the comments there last week about someone saying, don't always... You don't always have to hit a driver in a par four. That is actually very true. But just with me, with my R game at the minute, my five wood and my woods and all not being great, I think it's the only club I can really trust. So maybe I need to put a little bit more trust in me of, on the irons and stuff. But driver in hand, 321 yards, slight dog like to the right. Just going to try and go straight and hopefully it turns. Oh my god, that is so good. I mean, that is so good. Wow. That is actually massive. Let's go and see where that is. 63 yards. Should maybe hit a 50. Should maybe hit a wedge here, but I don't think I'm going to get it. I'd have to kill it. So I'm just going to play a nice little soft pitching wedge. Try and get one down. 63 yards. Just be good. Kick right if you can. Oh my god, it's actually landed on the green. Went to land it well before it. Anyway, two pot par. We're still on the green. It's not bad. We'll take it. Oh. Go take the flag out because it's leaning slightly to the to the right there for you, my left. So go take it out. I'm going to go for it. I'm not going to try and go close. I'm just trying to go for it. If I go a little bit past it, I can get the par. Slightly downhill as well. Jesus. Slow down. Slow down. Slow 
Well, fuck me, I went for it. All right, Jesus Christ. Downhill as well. What was I at? Silly putts, silly shots around the greens are messing me up a little bit. This is for par. Davy three putt, possibly four putt here. This is for bogey, oh my God. There's the bogey, oh my God. Davy three putt made a return there. On the green and two and three putt it. Very bad green reading that is. Very, very bad green reading. But anyway, it's number bogey and on we go to the next. Oh, 1,695 yards playing uphill, par three. Uh, I'm gonna play a five wood. Let's just try and get one down there. Come in a little bit, come in a little bit. We're up there left hand side. We've got a chip over a bunker here, guys, which could be very interesting. We're up there anyway. Shot two, 58 degree in hand. It's just gonna try and hopefully get one on the pin here. This is a really tricky pin. Oh, that's went nowhere. I don't like my next shot, guys. Don't like my next shot. Look at this for a weird lie. This is for shot free. This is for par. If can get this in, oh my god, that'd be great. It's not in, but it's close enough for bogey, hopefully. So, she's not in, guys, as I said, but it is close enough for bogey. Hopefully we can get it. Hopefully we can get it. Oh my god, just about made that. And that's a bogey, guys. On hole 16, and on we go to hole 17. Hole 17, par 4, 323 yards. I think the target here, guys, is going to be the big bushy tree. I say big bushy tree, yeah, it is a big bushy tree. Straight ahead down there, if I can get one to go over that. Hopefully it just fades in. Hoping, here's the hoping. Oh my god, that's so, that should be so good. That should be so good. Shot two. Drive well, actually went a good bit, a good distance there, I have to say. So, as my friend Clinton would say, seven iron bump and run. That's probably the play here. The, the fairways are so dry. Honestly, they're so dry. Bump and run this year. Hopefully, it just rolls close to the pin. Tell you what, this could be really good. This could be very good. I need to slow down. Slow down. Oh my god, you're not going to believe it. We're birdie putting. Honest to God, I've done it in the front line. And I got a nice little tap in birdie. Look at that there. If I would have stuck that in the air, I would have probably been short, left, right, or at the back. Come on. Can we get it? Honestly, see if this goes in. And it's, yeah. That's going to be my new shot for now. Seven iron from 180 yards to 100 yards. It's going to be a seven iron bumping on every time. Oh, it's just not enough pace. It's going to be tap in par. There we have it, guys. Par. On the 18th. Hole 18, par 4. I don't know who done the the yardages here, guys, because it says it's like 290 yards, and it's definitely not. It's like 370, 380. That's what it says on that board, anyway. But anyway, par 4. I'm trying to get a big saw drive down the middle. That's a saw drive there. Piped down the middle. Absolutely piped. Come on, what a strong finish here, come on. Absolute monster drive, guys. As I said, it's the, this hole's actually 347 yards. Uh, seven iron hand goal, do a nice little bump and run. Sitting about 60 yards, maybe 50 yards. Seven iron bump and run, nice and light one. Shouldn't be too bad, shouldn't be too bad. Guys, I'm not joking, that's my new shot. Seven iron bump and run, dirty putting. Can we finish strong with a birdie? Can we get the birdie and finish strong? Honestly, guys, that's my new uh, shot now. See, instead of sticking it in the air, I'm going to be playing a nice little seven iron bump and run. That's incredible. Oh my God, I've lipped it. I've literally lipped it. I thought I was getting the birdie to finish. Tap in par. There we have it, guys. Nice little tap in part of finish, but guys, hope you enjoyed this one. And uh, as I said, if you haven't liked the video yet, go down there and smash that like button. If you haven't subscribed, also do that as well. So uh, it's very much appreciated. But anyway, guys, there's a score below what we finished with, shooting over it. And as I said, guys, if you haven't liked the video, don't forget to go down there and smash that now. But until then, I'll see you next time in the channel with a new video. See you then.